there, YouTube. Mr. Fedora Man here, back again with another part of Let's Play the Spirit Engine. So, last time we got our orders from El Presidente, and now we are going to travel through Blue Sapphire Bay, the Jungle Tracks, to get to the village, which I believe is where the rebels are, um, you know, there. But let's go to Blue Sapphire Bay. There's no one else here. It's a beautiful sunny day and the beach is empty. Apart from those unfriendly looking sea creatures, it appears like they're scaring people away. Well, they would explain the lack of beautiful women in volleyball games. Gah, this is so unfair. All I wanted to do is spend a few hours relaxing. Is it really too much to ask for? It cannot be a coincidence that the local fauna are so hostile everywhere that we go. Something vital in the natural order is being seriously imbalanced. Maybe. Or maybe we're just really bad luck. I'm not usually this unfortunate, so it must be one of you two. Let's go kick these ugly crustaceans off our sunspot. No, they're pretty ugly looking. Uh, I should put like dynamite? No, magic bullet. <laughs> magic bullet. I guess a holy bolt while I'm there. Ow, faggot. Why'd you throw that at me? You asshole. Eat magic bullet. I'm pretty sure that that... That... Bleh. I'm pretty sure that poisonous steak thing that hit Zephyr is going to come more into play eventually. Come on. You want this? Eat it, fatty. Oh, it's get dominated. Don't close your face. I have to kill you first. Thank you. Continuing on. So this is probably going to be a more difficult area to go through. Sea Mares are canny mages who can launch a barrage of water magic against aggressors, often choosing to strike those who seek cover behind their comrades. Oh, that's not good. You are a Jew, sir. Being an ass like that. I'm gonna change your kinetic smash. So no, that's just kinetic smash the entire time. No, it's magic. Kinetic smash. And you don't have oh. Yeah. Ow. Hey, Peter, go on. Recover. Take care of this sea mare. Boom! Switch you back to magic. Yeah, you're gonna be doing a lot of switching back and forth between all this crap. I have to involve a little bit more strategy now after fighting those bounty hunters. Because unfortunately, after fighting those bounty hunters, lots of creatures now have status immunities and stuff like this. He's normal in energy. Strong, he's strong to that. So, ooh, it's gonna be a little bit more difficult to get through areas. You're gonna have to involve more strategy instead of just brute force like I've been doing so far. I've involved a bit of strategy, but I've got to involve a lot more if I want to get any of this done. You better not close, you fucking clam. Thank you. Yeah, the music here is really cool. So we just keep going after this guy. Magic, magic, magic. Bullet, bullet, bullet. Hope we can make it to a save. Boom, boom, boom. Dead. How close am I to a level up? Next battle, I'll be level 25. Are we at the end of the area? 
though? Not just yet. Let's just keep going through this. You're a Jew, sir. I'll switch this to Kinetic Smash. They're a magic immune, and we might as well get this kinetic smash going. And I leveled. Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention. Stupid me. Come on, shoot a bullet. Yeah. That was dumb, I let Zephyr die. Ah! Kill him, him. Boom. Sorry about that, Zephyr. Now Zephyr's back to life. Okay, let's go with. Hmm. I'm gonna go with Sharpshoot. Zephyr, you go with Party Heal, I assume, I guess. Uh, some damage in general. Yeah. Let's go with another. Death. Death. Are we at least reaching the end of this area? There we go. Ah, uh, please, could we stop for a moment? I don't feel very well. What's wrong now? You've been getting slower and slower the past five minutes. I want to rest too, but this is pathetic. Come on, pick up the pace. I think something may be seriously wrong, Peter. He looks quite ill. Zephyr, where does it hurt? My stomach is twisting, my arms tingle, they're weak, and, I feel, and they feel like they're burning. It's so painful. Ah, help me. It must be poisoned. Poisoning. No no naturally transmitted disease comes on so fast. The last dart which that skull faced assassin struck must have carried it. This is not good. Poison? What about us? Could we have been poisoned too? My throat has been a little hoarse since we left the city and my head is a little fuzzy. Don't worry about don't worry about yourself. If either of us had been poisoned like this, we would know about it, and it is highly unlikely to be a contagious agent. Alright then. Damn it, this is really low. That gutless underhand coward. You have to admit his efficiency, though, no matter how unpleasant his work ethic is. What do we do now? I'm embarrassed to say that my knowledge of poisons is limited. I have no idea what agent is involved here. The assassin must keep stocks of an antidote, though. Our best hope is to find him and acquire it. I don't know where to begin looking, though. I'm sure he's quite anxious to find for us to find him. He said that he would meet us again. Looks like we'll just have to wait until he forces a confrontation on his terms. Hey, Zephyr, can you walk again? I can walk. It's feeling a little better now. Let's get going quick. Please, I know I mustn't slow us down too much. Well, that's not good. The inky pit. Oh, there he is. What in the world are you doing here? You are told never to contact us in person. Apologies, client. My enthusiasm is responsible for this temporary lapse in concentration. It will not happen again. You had better not. What do you have to say? I trust you've gutted our portly errant. No, Duant lives, but his saviors are none other than the top gold bounty. Little wonder that so many hunters cannot find them, and that these three who did lay dead by the roadside. They are formidable characters. Really? Intriguing. You have been such an impress impressive employee in the past, but I assume even you were beaten? No, not beaten. Most of my affiliations died at their hands, but I can break them yet. They have no choice but to come to me. When they do, I will I will repay them in kind. It will merely take a little time. I will draw them here and deal with them for you, my clients. Or my clients. Very well, but I want them to li I want them alive. Do you hear? No matter how dangerous they have become, the spirit is still tied to them. Oh, and avoid the western jungle when you leave. Republican troops are amassing there, and you will be and they will be coming this way soon. We will be elsewhere by the time they start attacking the rebels. You should too. Hey, so on the subject, uh, we should be moving. The loading schedule is complete now, and we are still behind schedule. Angela, relying solely on a mercenary is not always the best idea. The company has found this out the hard way in the past. He's already failed us once. What if he does so again? It can't hurt to let him try. He knows what he's doing. Besides, I received the background checks I had ordered on the three of them based on the descriptions the Circle gave us this morning. They are less direct, less violent ways to bring them out to us, my dear Mr. Walters. Bring me one of these quaint locals and a spare pad of paper. We shall get him to leave them a message. Ooh, mysterious. So, with that, um, we have to continue on to the jungle tracks. 
Um, but we'll have to do that next time on Let's Play the Spirit Engine. So this is Mr. Fedora Man, signing off. Bye.